One feature I find especially fun is the touchscreen control. To have all the options available at your fingertips is definitely worth some more effort. Note this option is only available if you have at least two outputs on your GPU. First you have to choose a suitable touchscreen. It has to be the same resolution as your projector, otherwise it won't work. Next connect the devices and power up. When setting the two screens on your computer, make sure they are next to each other horizontally. The application should be on the primary screen and touch screen control on the secondary. Be aware that you'll have to calibrate the touch screen. By default, the touch control works on the primary display and we want it to be on the auxiliary one. Open the calibrate the screen for pen or touch input and press setup. A text will appear telling you to identify the screen as the touch screen. Tap the touch screen only if it shows the message. Otherwise, press enter, then wait until you see the text on the touch screen and tap it. That's it, calibration done. The full description of all the options available along with the download links can be found in the video description. Watch the quick demonstration of the touch screen control. It sure looks great, and yet there is one more upgrade you can make to further expand the functionality of your sandbox. You can easily connect a tablet or other similar device and use it as a wireless touch controller. To do it you will need a tablet, dummy HDMI plug and a Wi-Fi router. Note this option is only available if you have at least two outputs on your GPU. First, download and install an application called Spacedesk on both tablet and your PC. It is used to cast the computer screen onto a mobile device. There are plenty of such applications, but this one surely works and you can download it for free. Controller. Connect the Wi-Fi router to the internet and your PC to the router using an Ethernet cable. Turn it on. On the tablet, connect to the internet via this exact device. Now open Spacedesk on both devices. Make sure the status is on on the PC and tap to connect on the mobile device. On the computer, open display settings and duplicate desktop on 2 and 3. Now the secondary display, which is the touch control, should appear on your tablet. Open the Kinect Sandbox app and enjoy!